Hey everybody, welcome back. James here with you today. And we took out the modified Hatfield single barrel brake action 12 gauge that I had the work done to. And we were using the improved cylinder choke since I added the choke system in there, Accu Choke from Mossberg. That's what I had done to it. And the reason why I put the improved cylinder in there because we were shooting rifled slugs. Winchester Super X one ounce rifled slugs at two and three quarter inch length. And we were shooting those at 50 yards with the center point red dot. So let me show you. So we were using these guys right here in the hat field and this is what I was getting. About three inch group overall at 50 yards with the red dot. That is pretty good. I probably would have tightened it up just a hair more, but after the seventh shot through that gun, my shoulder was completely numb. Um, this has to be what, probably one of the most powerful recoil feeling guns that I own. My 30 out 6 doesn't even kick that bad. I mean, I was, I'd have to shoot about 50 rounds through the 30 out 6 to even feel what this gun did to me within two rounds. And my shoulder, like I said, was completely numb and it kicks like a mule if you couldn't tell from the video. But, you know, that's what I get for modifying it since it's my gun and uh, I've tested it out that's all it is it's just testing and seeing how it turns out 
Uh, am I glad I did it? Yeah. Um, it's sighted in for shotgun now, shotgun season, if I want to use it for deer or just to take out and let people shoot it just to feel the recoil. But anyways, I got this kind of a requested video just to see how well uh, slugs would shoot out of it because this is a really popular shotgun and uh, you know people want to know. Um, like I said, I've used it. I've shot a slug through it before I had the work done and it wasn't bad. It was kind of low, but other than that, it was a good shooting gun. Um, but now that I had the work done to it with the Accu choke system and the, the mounting, I can have my own sight instead of just the bead. It's going to be more accurate at longer distance. But yeah, I just wanted to share this and uh, hope you guys like it. Appreciate you watching. We'll see you on the next video.